This island has a very sad and dark past. For close to a century, this island was used by authorities to forcibly isolate and quarantine people. The quarantine station was built in 1874. For 25 years, ships plagued with typhoid, scarlet fever, measles and smallpox were sent to its shores to isolate and bury their dead. The stone jetty you see today was built by prisoners and completed in 1893. Well, we've arrived. It's about 5 p.m. Yeah, the sun's setting quick and uh, it's low tide at the moment, but it's, uh, it's really starting to roar in here. I'll show you in a moment. So I'm just gonna carry the last of the, uh, the stuff up. It was a pretty uh, rough trip over. The wind really picked up. It must have been blowing at least uh, 20 knots. Yeah, I wasn't expecting that, so it got a bit wet on the way over, so I'm feeling a bit cold. It's a nice campsite, though. The forecast for the rest of the weekend is pretty good. I'll show you where we're uh, sitting up here in just a moment. Yeah, we're a little bit sheltered. Not allowed campfires here, unfortunately. The wind's still howling and the uh, sun's dropping quick, so it's getting a bit cold. I thought I'd uh, boil some water and uh, have a coffee. I'm just gonna get the uh, windshield out here. Looking forward to this. And that windshield, I think, will make a big difference. While that water's boiling for the coffee, I'm thinking I might uh, try and hang a light up because uh, the sun's dropping pretty quick and it's going to be dark here in a moment. Yeah, that should work well. That tide's really ripping in, so I'm just gonna uh, bring the jet ski in a bit further. By 1900, the island was transformed into a prison for vagrants and alcoholics. But the longest use for the island was as a leper colony from 1907 until it was finally closed in 1959. You're gonna to have to keep shifting it as that tide comes in. Uh, I might go, uh, yeah, warm myself up with the coffee now. Use a little coffee sachet. It was an isolated, harsh, and grim place with many tragic stories, including a leper who was encaged in a wooden box and transported to the island on a cargo ship, and a mother who was wrongly diagnosed and taken away from her two young children for over a decade. That's good. That's nice.
coming up to 2 a.m. The cries of a curly bird made for an eerie night solo camping. Try to get back to sleep. Join us next week as we settle into camp life and explore the island and surrounding waters. If you enjoyed the video, please click subscribe. It's totally free and helps grow the channel. Well, thanks for joining me today. Hang in there and I'll see you next time.